some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Comron beats. Comron beats. Comron beats. Comron beats. Zed Club. Zed Club. Zed Club. Zed
Kamran Beats. Kamran Beats. Kamran Beats. Zed Club. Zed Club. Comron beats, Comron beats, Comron beats, Comron beats. Zed Club, Zed Club, Zed Club.
Comron Beats. Comron Beats. Comron Beats. Comron Beats. Z the club. Z the club. Z the club. Foremost, I want to say RP FBG Duck, man. Long live Big Cloud, bro. Um, you know, usually I wouldn't even post a video like this, but being that it's such a big case, and I've been, you know, covering it for since the beginning, and I've been fucking with Duck and the whole, I've been in the, you know, fucking with the whole movement before all this happened. And on top of that, it's not as clear and graphic as, you know, I'm pretty sure they got clearer videos, but. You know, I felt like this one was, but this is, this is important just to show how motherfuckers can throw their life away, you know what I'm saying? And destroy your life and the family in a sense, and their families. These fools was recorded the entire time. Old block. These niggas was, these niggas on tape the whole time. Like, I don't know what people, what, 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 what niggas think, but, um, this ain't the nineties. You rallying up to go do an assassination in the middle of the fucking day in a suburban area. I mean, anywhere, really. It's 2000, it's the 2020s. Everything is on camera. It's been like that since 2010 and 2009 and five, but right now, now niggas just threw their whole life away. There's no way y'all, there's no way they couldn't say that was them. There's no way. These niggas get branded tags. These niggas got the whole footage. They got all them witnesses that was out there that day. These niggas ran up just broad day like like niggas is out of control, bro. Um, it's a shame, man. You know what I'm saying? It's a shame. I need all my young boys to learn from this. It's a lose lose, bro. It's a lose lose, and then there's more losses on each side because extended family and kids and moms lost these. Now they gotta go to jail forever. Now you know it's just a total fucking loss, man. And with seeing footage like this, you can't feel sorry for these niggas, bro. You know what I'm saying? For one, they just was reckless as hell. For two, it's not like they was out and he seen them and they got into it. Like, them niggas specifically darted all the way down to the Gold Coast just to go assassinate FBG Duck, bro. It's sad, bro. Like, But, you know, that's what that street life gets you. You know what I'm saying? Even with Duck, even though everybody say Duck was good and da da da, you know he was a part of that street life. You know what I mean? It, the good niggas, it be the good niggas too. You know what I'm saying? Is is they you, what they say? The good guys always, you know what I'm saying? The good ones always go first type shit. You know what I mean? Um, shout out to Mama Duck, man. She rallied for her son's, you know, freedom, regardless of what they say. You know what I'm saying? It was a couple of celebrations I seen. I was like, ah. But I mean, how can I tell her? That's her son. You know what I'm saying? I can't really tear her out of grief or how to feel after all that. Going and looking, you know, her son killers in the face. And that was just like reckless and brutal. You know what I'm saying? Them niggas just, it, it, like I said, it wasn't like they was out and about and they seen each other. Them niggas was chilling in they hood in O Block. On a regular summer day, them niggas like they was on the block smoking weed, and these niggas ran all the way down there. You got them on camera running up the shit, running down the shit. Niggas got the same outfits on, the same hoodies. You got the you got the whole car traveling on the freeway, back on the freeway. Them swerving between, them hopping like it's uh, y'all did that to y'all self and ruined a life and ruined y'all lives. Like I said, 
that street shit ain't worth it, bro. Like, it don't pay. Now, these niggas, these niggas couldn't even get, they had public defenders. They couldn't even afford lawyers, bro. And they cool with Dirk and they cool with these people. But when you, it don't matter. You know what I mean? It don't matter. When you shit get like, into, when you get into that shit, when shit defend, don't nobody want nothing to do with you. And they ain't trying to let, they trying to fund nothing. I'm pretty sure Dirk had the money. He can he could get them a more, more decent lawyer than a public defender, but he don't want to be attached to that. And then nigga, y'all all on camera, y'all did it on camera like that. And then he bought the he don't want to waste his money in damn way. I think Muwa was the only one with a lawyer, a real lawyer, and that's because of what. Whatever, I don't even want to go into speculation. But R.P. Big Cloud man, long little duck. Y'all let me know your thing. Like, comment, subscribe, notification bell. I'm gone. Yeah. Hey, stop what you're doing right now. Please go to the description and go follow the main channel. Subscribe and follow the main channel. IQ Shahid, we're on the road to 100K. 100K, man. Appreciate y'all, man.